Father in heaven, I pray you give, give every one of us insight as we read the scripture. Holy Spirit, take over in Jesus' name. But as it is written, shall we read? But as it is written, I have not seen, nor hear her, nor have entered into the heart of man the things which God has prepared for those who love him. There are things God has prepared for those who love him. You love God. Good, let's go. But God has revealed it to us again. God has revealed to us for the last time. God has revealed to us through His Spirit. The things God has prepared for you because you love Him, they can only be revealed. Did you hear me? You can only receive them by revelation. You can pray, you pray, you pray. But if you are not working with the Holy Spirit, this will not be downloaded into your spirits. You are just praying. You see why believers are struggling? You see why believers are in pain? Because they have no relationship the with the Holy Spirit. It is through that relationship with the Holy Spirit that the Holy Spirit Himself will come and give you information about the thing you are praying for. He will give information. What's that to take? It says, But God has revealed to us through what? Through his spirit. For the spirit searches all things. Yes, the deep things of God. <laughs> the deep things of God. The deep things of God. Maybe you are still on the surface. The Bible says there are deep things of God. By the time the Holy Ghost takes you and I to the deep things of God, that is where you just that's where you just keep saying awesome. So what is going to say? Oh, so because you are just saying some things that <laughs> that you you can't just talk about. You can't just say that it's just like uh, the experience of Paul. Paul telling all the things he saw when he was caught up to third heaven that there are things he cannot share, cannot tell us. Let's go to the next verse and see. For what man knows the things of a man except the spirit of the man which is in him? Even mm -hmm. so, no one knows the things of God except Oh, Let's take that again. Even so, no one knows the things of God except No one knows the things of God except the spirit of God. So the things you are running to the mountain, running to the valley, to valley, running to people to tell you, to show you, the Bible says the spirit of God knows all things. Again, the spirit of God knows how many things. So if you engage him, if you spend time with him in fellowship, in communion, the Holy Ghost for you. Okay, we give all things to you. Somebody say, Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Even so, no one knows the things of God except the Spirit of God. Let's take the next verse. Now we have received not the Spirit of the world, but the Spirit who is from God, that we might know the things that have been freely given to us by God. This is show. At this picture. Blesses me so much. This scripture that no believer should be ignorant, living in ignorance. You know, I don't know what to do. I, I've never said, said something like that. Yeah. I don't know what to do. I think I'm confused. I think, I think, I think, no, don't talk like that. The more you say, I don't know what to do, I think I'm confused, the more you get confused. The more you get confused. The Bible says, now we have received. What have we received? What have we received? The Spirit who is from God. That is the Holy Spirit. 